It's no secret that a math revolution is underway as more and more emphasis is being placed on test scores. Almost everyone has heard of Singapore math. Well, in 1980, Singapore and the United States were both ranked poorly among all of the countries testing math achievement. But in 1993, Singapore shot to the top, ranking number one, while the U.S. continues to rank low. Many educators have been exploring what Singapore is doing differently. The content hasn't changed in these successful schools. Rather, the pedagogy behind how the content is taught has. Singapore math, or standards-based math, is built upon the principle that students are much more successful when we teach concepts from concrete, to representational, to abstract. This differs from the traditional math instruction in that the goal is not to teach concepts a mile wide and an inch deep, focusing on skill and drill. Rather, the goal is to explore fewer topics in greater depth and then revisit those topics spiraling at a higher level each time, allowing students to really establish a solid understanding of math concepts. Thinking Kids Math was created to support the theory that in order to be successful in math, students need to learn how to think about, know, apply, and reason with math concepts. Early math instruction is so critical because what students learn in elementary school is the basis of all future math learning. Thinking Kids Math focuses on problem solving, the why and the how, so that kids can really build math fluency. So let me tell you a little bit more about Thinking Kids Math. It was really designed to be used in centers, but it's also perfect for small groups and for one-on-one -on -one guided practice. Good job. Now let's read what our directions told us to do here. What's the last part? Who has the longest path? Who has the longest path? Can you circle that? Job. How do you think we'll know if they had the longest path? Because it's so far this one back. Mm -hmm. Can we count the cubes and see who has the most cubes? Okay. So you're right. Seven was the largest number. Good job. Each grade level kit contains 84 two-sided write-on wipe-away cards a 25-page teacher's guide with reproducibles, and an easy-to-use storage box with five tab dividers separating each concept so that you can easily keep everything organized. Each activity card aligns with a specific NCTM standard with teaching objectives, model and practice, assessment, extension activities, and direction for the teacher and a colorful, engaging learning experience for the student on the other side. We know that your instruction time, your prep time, and your resources are valuable, so we wanted to give you an opportunity to see just how Thinking Kids Math really works. We've developed a sample for you to download and review on our website. We've also developed downloadable diagnostic tools for each grade level. You can use these assessments to identify where the knowledge gaps are in your kids and exactly which activity cards to use for remediation or guided practice. We think you're going to love Thinking Kids Math. For more information about the Pre-K through Grade 1 Foundations Kit, the Kindergarten Kit, First Grade Kit, or Second Grade Kit, visit your local teacher supply store. They're available now.